and, we'll, and welcome back. And we're going to tackle area 11, and if we have time, area 12, which will be the final level of the game. Which has a rewind button on the sands of time here. Cross here because it's the only way. Big ass brutes who just completely disappear when you shoot them instead of leaving corpse. Robots which don't leave any bullets. Although at this point you should have enough health. Once you go into this door, begin checkpoint. It's time to play Tarzan. Oh, I cannot do it, Tarzan Yell. And fuck, I went I screw that up. Let's try this again. Damn it. Take three. The door. Grab it there and grab it, and we make it to the door. And now this guy is commanding lasers, which all you have to do is climb to the top and shoot them. Completely useless. And there's area 11. We should have plenty of time for area 12. And the end of the game. Obtained bulletproof vest, which is a rather good item. It'll block every other bullet that comes at you, but it will not. But you get it so late in the game, it makes it almost completely worthless. It's only good for essentially area 12. But we can bring it with us. Rocket launcher. My brother is here. And he is going to try to bug me while I'm doing my commentary on Area 12. I believe you have to talk to Super Joe to open up the door here. You're gonna have to listen to what he says, though. The elevator down. You can go through the top door, but it's easier to climb up. I do just climb up through here. Avoid the electric shocks, or they will do that to you. No confidence. And continue climbing up to the top. And ride the elevator down again. Drop. I don't think you have to get the communication actually. But this door, you do not want to go in. In the American version, there's actually a ball that will drop from the top there. But instead, they have a dude throwing, rock, throwing boulders at you. Avoid this door. You do not want to go in there. There's no way out, and you cannot destroy that reactor. You have to be very careful with the time on that last one. This is the reactor you want to go to. It's just like the last one, except now there's enemies dropping from the sky. Actually, it is just like the last one. In the American version, there's enemies dropping from the sky. And die faster. Just throw spiked balls at me. 
avoid the door there. You don't need to go in. And that unlocks this barrier. Finally, you come down here. Spike pit. This will take your bionic skills to the test as you spin across. Brother's nicotine smell is getting to me. I don't know why he smokes. And here's generally smoke kilts. Or I don't know what he is in the Japanese version, gables or whatever. Or whoever the hell would be alive today. And he's trying to revive Hitler, but he figured out how the how to fix the albatross, so they don't need him after all. What? It's exploding on him. Oh no. And there he dies and out steps. Master D in the American version, but they still use the same sprite, which is quite obviously Adolf Hitler. And they say, you're going to fight against me? You're a damn fool. I'll show you the horror of the albatross. What you have to do is you have to stand on this platform, wait for the fire to pass, wait for the fire to pass, this thing up, and deal as much damage as you can to the tail before it moves out of the way. Then repeat the process. If you're fast, you can usually end it pretty soon. You can shoot the door, you can shoot the arm up. And there it goes. Finally, you talk to this guy named Hal, who gives you a bazooka, which looks exactly like the rocket launcher. And you have to shoot at the cockpit of the helicopter as you drop down. Just like that. I practiced for many years to be able to do that perfectly. And you get to see Adolf Hitler's head explode. There are many animated gifs of this on the internet if you just look for them. Satisfying. And finally, the last area in the game. You have 60 seconds to escape with a colossus blocking your path. Just keep climbing. It's really not that hard. You can kill the colossus, even though you can't see his health. It takes four shots on the rocket launcher to kill, just like normal. Just like that. And there's nothing to stop you from escaping. You don't even need to climb onto that last thing. You just press down. Is Super Joe still inside? Where is he? You gotta go save him. Or whatever the hell he says there. Where's the commander? We can't wait for him any longer. We're going to evacuate. Please wait just a bit more. Wait, what's that? as the entire enemy base goes up in smoke. Mushroom cloud! No, that's not a mushroom cloud. It's just a cloud with Brad Spencer hanging off a helicopter with Super Joe in his arm. And that's the end of the main theme playing. Yeah! Says Duffman. And then you go back and it's a victory party. 1989. 1989 4 7. Would that be 4th of July? Or would it be the 7th of April? And that's it. That's 
the Japanese Bionic Commando. Hope you enjoyed this let's play and I'll see you around the net. <laughs>